Okay, another Dracovest video. You might notice that I've put up two videos at once of this one. What you're watching right now is like the director's cut, which uh, is basically the highlights from the Morningstar tournament. Because when it comes down to it, filming as many fights as I did film kind of equaled a lot of footage. There is a longer version of this video if you want to go have a look at that. I will leave a card up in the corner somewhere or there'll be a link in the description below as well. If you want to go see like the full version, everything that I filmed from the tournament, all the fights, you can go have a look there. What this video is, is kind of just my favorite bits or my favorite couple of fights to kind of give you a taster, a little, little taster of what it's all about. Or if you just don't have time to sit through like a half an hour long video, you can just watch this one and come back to the longer one later if you want. Without further ado, this is the version of the video that just has my favorite parts from the tournament. The rest of it, it's like all the same. Okay, okay so it is uh, it's the first morning of Dragon Fest. So we got here really late last night. It was like last rain and all the cars were lined up and it took it forever. The update is it's still raining and it's still mucky as fuck. Uh, but we're here, at least. I kind of have a feeling today is going to consist of like sitting in tents and uh, looking at the rain outside because it is lashing rain and it's just muck everywhere. Usually it's like sunny from the start and it's really really warm but then it's like it might rain one or two days and then it'll dry up immediately. It's already raining here now. The rain is really putting me off. What? I'm going to town, you want to join? It's raining. Ha! Tell me the water, it's liquid sunshine mate. <laughs> That's not what rain is. It's also a bit cold as well, so we have like a fire going. At least we have meat. And we have mead. All, all we can do is sit around and drink alcohol. That's the only thing we can do. I did hear that this is like the worst conditions for Drakenfest since like 2008. Like anyone at home who's watching is like, oh that place looks shit. It is a bit shit, but it's not normally like this. Hey Tank, you having a good time? You having a good time? Answer the question. I also don't know why it got so dark there. Uh, I don't know what's up with this camera. So we decided to get food to make ourselves feel better because the weather's so fucking miserable and we had to walk in the rain. It's all gone. I also got a little brat bratwurst thingy that you can get right in there. A little small but they're pretty tasty. I also bought a cup. The one thing you should always get is get yourself a cup more than a drinking horn. You can put it down on a table and you can wash it way easier. Later on in the week, get yourself a drinking horn uh, just for something cool to drink out of them. Hot tip. It's like our group's tournament is still going on today, even though it's lashing rain and it's really muddy. So I'll go down and I'll film that bit as well. Not a huge amount, just a little bit. I mean, if you want to see tournaments, you can go to the years before. And uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm about to start doing the whole group tournament thing. We used to do a whole three point system where you hit a guy three times, and he hits you three times, and whoever gets hit the most is out. But uh, this year they're doing like whoever fights better gets through and it's put up to a vote. I think it's uh, a better way to do it. It's just kind of encouraging the fight to look better. So, you know, it makes better videos anyway. The only thing is, it's Ash and Rain it, and it's really fucking murky. And I don't know if I want to go through all that. I go for a little bit, but I don't think I'm going to film as much from the tournament this year as I have in the past. It just takes a lot, and there's a lot of editing later on. And I mean, if you want to see tournaments, you can see the videos from last year and stuff, and I've got smoke in my eyes. There's also fucking tons more people in the group this year, so it would take ages to film it all. So it's really not feasible. Sorry about that. I hope you understand that it's just really hard, and I'm going to be freezing, and there's smoke everywhere. I'll get more over the week that will keep us watching, hopefully. We should have judges on both sides. Okay. Alright, you two will be on this side, Anna and I will be on the other side. Up, okay. uh, 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 oh, look at you! Whoa! I put two couples on him! I don't think anyone is betting against you. Who's the rival? Gail! Who's Gail? This is Gail! Oh, nice to meet you! Begin! <laughs> Let's finish this. 
Show me your money, love. I actually wasn't expecting as much as we've put on out there this year. It's definitely a way better way of doing the tournament because it's actually like, really fun to watch. But yeah, that's all the tournament for this year. And this battery's probably dead and I'm talking to a camera that's not even turned on at the moment. So there you go. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'll say it again though that there's uh, the longer full version of everything I filmed from the tournament more or less in uh, the description down below. Or I'll leave like an end screen tile to it as well. That one's probably going to be about a half an hour long. So when you have time you can come back to that one or if you don't want to bother, grand, you just watch this one, that's fine. And yeah, I'm going to be a huge scab and ask about this again, but Drakenfest kind of got hard to afford this year and uh, if you want to maybe help lessen that burden for next year and if maybe you just really appreciated me making these videos, I have a Patreon 
that I will link at the end of this video up on the screen. If you don't know what Patreon is, Patreon is a tipping and rewards website, which lets viewers kind of leave a tip for content creators that they appreciate. You don't have to do this, there's no like obligation to. Uh, I'm not gonna like start only uploading videos there and not here because the people didn't pay money. It's just like, if you appreciate me making these videos and you wanna kinda help ensure that I'm there next year, Maybe, you know, drop me a euro or two euro or something. In saying you don't ever have to do this and I'm not gonna like look down on anyone who doesn't or anything like that. Likes and shares are also appreciated. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like a huge scab asking that, but it's just, it got kind of tough this year. But yeah, that's all for this video. I'll have another one up tomorrow, I believe. And uh, I hope you enjoy it. So I will see you tomorrow.